would say my experience in the School of Mass Communications at USF has been the perfect balance of challenging and rewarding. I'm part of the ZAP LLC and there's about 29 members. We all live together, we're the same major, and it's given me a lot of options considering I thought I was going to be coming into this university and a little lost. It's a big school, so it makes it a group effort. And welcome to Florida Focus. I'm Stephanie Becerra. Everyone here is very inviting. The teachers are always giving advice. So if you have a question like you, um, you're always ready there to answer anything we need. The USF experience was very valuable to me uh, in my career. Um, no way I am where I am today without going through the program. It's a very family-oriented program. This great institution inspired me to dream big. And it taught me how to succeed. It gave me confidence. It educated me. And yes, it inspired me. Three, Freda music. two, one. Freda Bobrini graphic. Journalists take complicated topics, giant pieces of information, and they boil them down into these digestible bites. That's what I learned to do at USF. I think that's what's great about the USF um, mass communications program and the journalism program is that if you are the type of person that wants to apply yourself and wants to see how far you can you can go in this industry, the the people at USF mass comfortable facilitate that and are so eager to help you out and, and get you to where you want to be. Just the faculty, all the experience they had, you know, and just the knowledge they gave to all the students uh, while I was there and it was invaluable being able to learn from folks who are actually in the industry instead of just, you know, reading from a book. I see, um, you know, a lot of room for opportunity here for students and I also see um, professors that really care about um, you know, the success of their students and what their students are learning and what they want to focus on. Coming up on eight to seven. You know, if I could tell my younger self some secret based on what I know now about the business, I wish that I had known um, how much time and energy you really have to devote to this. So I feel like I've really got that in me now that I'm prepared to go find a story, shoot it, get the right questions answered, put it on, you know, to edit and everything and then get it on air. Just to have those connections and building that network so when you're done it's not like all right what do I do now? You know you have people you can fall back on, you have own issues you can go to. Jordan Zimmerman is right when he says there will be nothing like this program anywhere in the world. Here I can go internship somewhere in Tampa and with the skills I'm learning here I can take it right down the street, I have a connection, you can network with them and you'll probably get an internship and then maybe get a job one day if they like you and you work hard. Apply yourself, get out into the real world, see if you know that's something that you're gonna like um, and if it is like run with it. There's no better way to spend 10 million dollars than on education at the university that gave you your start and for each and every one of you to propel your dreams and your careers.